Uh, but I think what the hunger strike really reflects is the absolute despair of the people who are down there. Uh, their, the hopelessness of the situation, the fact that the United States and everybody else has forgotten them. And uh, let me just go on. There are 166 people at Guantanamo. Of those, there are probably at most 20 guys who were bad guys who were taken in later, guys like Khalid Sheikh Mohammed. The other people are at most nothing, more than half of them, 86 of them have been cleared at least for three years, and some during the Bush administration, cleared as innocent people, and they're still there, and they're frustrated. I think, in a way, we concentrate too much on the treatment. I mean, I don't care if you're held in the Dorchester Hotel in London, or the best hotel, the Ritz-Carlton in Moscow, and you're confined to that room for 11 years, and you can't see your family, you can't go out and talk to people, you can't read freely, you can't get about, I don't care, that's a lousy condition even if you're fed the best food every day. And believe me, they're not. I mean, they are imprisoned improperly without a chance to get out. That's the worst condition.